New tonight, the search is on for a man police say sexually abused a teen at a public library in Davis. Investigators believe the abuse happened on several occasions. CBS 13's Jennifer McGraw is live in Davis this evening with more on the man police are looking for. Jen. Yeah, police tell us this happened a few weeks ago, but it took so long for this teen to come forward. He said that he was scared, but again, they're looking for somebody who molested this teen in the bathroom. It's a public library filled with people constantly in and out, and for many, the last place they would suspect an assault. It's kind of uh, surprising and uh, infuriating in a way. Abel and Sweta isn't alone. I'm surprised someone would uh, go that far to molest a child in a public bathroom. Davis police say a teen came forward weeks after the attack, saying he was sexually assaulted by a man in the bathroom stall several times over a several week period. The library has young people there uh, looking at computers and reading books, and so it's a uh, you know, for lack of a better word, a target rich environment. And Swit the works with high schoolers who wait at the library until parents are off work. He says he's not surprised it took the teens so long to come forward. They're victims and they feel like it's their fault sometimes that this is happening to them, so it's terrible. The library has surveillance cameras from one end to the other, and police have a detailed description. The suspect is a described as a tall, thin white man with short curly gray hair and facial hair carrying a blue shoulder bag. They may frequent the library. They may have um, information that they don't even realize they do. And again, this is very much an ongoing investigation, but if you have any information that can help police out, give them a call. All right, Jennifer McGraw reporting live for us tonight in Davis. Thanks.